Danger Dolan. From exploring the wonders of space by force to fountains of cuteness, we count 15 of the greatest glitches that have broken our games. Number 15. Minecraft. This game sold for over $2 billion, which is a solid reminder that you don't need excellent coding or graphics to make a beloved game. All you need is an interesting idea and a shitload of luck. This glitch occurs thanks to the cat's teleporting ability, and if you do it right, you can have a never-ending fountain of cute balls of fluff and blocks. If you find this glitch hypnotic, just know you're not the only one, as I myself have watched this clip over and over because I really don't know how to stop. Number 14. Bloodborne is a fantastic game with an assortment of technical issues holding it back, such as a long loading screen, long frame rates, quests rendered incompletable because of a glitch, but this glitch is one that should remain in the game just because of its comedic value. This witch would like to excuse herself because her planet needs her. Either that or she's possessed by the eternal spirit of Thor, the god of thunder, and needs to return to Valhalla to slap Loki around for a bit. Number 13. FIFA 12. And FIFA is one of the most popular series worldwide, with soccer fans all over the world rushing to buy the game each year it comes out. It's even popular with those that generally don't like video games. However, the games aren't without hilarious faults. This one in particular never fails to amuse me and anyone that watches it. I mean, who doesn't love seeing two players express their love for soccer and for each other? Number 12. The best way to describe Fallout New Vegas is an RPG western set in a post-apocalyptic wasteland with a 50s aesthetic that also happens to be filled with bugs. But the bugs in New Vegas aren't that giant tarantula hawk kind of bug that give you no end of grief, there's also the game breaking kind. Private Ackerman may be glad that he's still alive, but I'm not sure if becoming one of the headless undead really counts as belonging to the world of the living. I'm not sure it's funnier the fact that this glitch exists or the fact that it has occurred multiple times and in comedic situations. Number 11. FIFA 13. I wanted to just have one game series per glitch, but FIFA has some tremendous glitches and to only show one would be a genuine shame. Also they fit together so well that I couldn't resist putting it in. I mean goddamn, just look at this. How can you look at this glitch and tell me it isn't a true piece of art? The awkward humping, the failed attempts to struggle out of the way of green man's pelvic thrusts, this gif should be displayed in the Louvre in place of the Mona Lisa. Number 10. Grand Theft Auto 5. So GTA is a well-known series for its wacky satire on society, violent crimes, and sandbox environments. It's also well known for the developers that just simply just don't give a flying fuck about any negative reactions towards the brutal violence found in their games. Well this glitch replicates true life in an amazing way. Two characters arguing with bullets hitting them and causing blood to spurt out of their necks, backs, chests, just unintentionally shows how the violence in GTA really isn't meant to be taken seriously. Number 9. LA Noir. Rockstar games are always full of entertaining mishaps and glitches, and LA Noir is no exception, despite its serious nature, more realistic and gritty themes. So have you ever had issues hiding your ability to fly? Well, this guy seems to have none of which as he carefully descends when no one's looking. As far as the other two know, he simply walked up to the couch and flopped on the cushion. Number 8. Saints Row 4. One of the most ridiculous games of all time. It started as a simple GTA clone and evolved into a game in which you play as the President of the United States with superpowers and a simulation of a simulation. Every lady wants a specific body type, most common of which is the hourglass figure. But this lady destroys your stereotypes with the unknown curly bracket shape and god damn does she pull it off. Number 7. Skate. It seems I have an affinity for games that have glitches that launch you into the stratosphere. Either that or when I went looking for glitches I was just naturally drawn to the pseudo flyers. This man gets the karma he deserves, I mean... Why would you go up to someone minding his own business and smack him with your skateboard? Clearly, the developers put this in the game on purpose as a feature to punish the sinners. 
Number six, Heavy Rain. This game is really just interactive fiction, but that doesn't mean it isn't worth playing. Just bear in mind that there's a bunch of quick time events and the game will more than likely depress you in one way or another. That is, until you come across this glitch that I like to call press X to Sean, 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 and so on and so forth. If you do come across press X to Sean at this pivotal point of the game, be prepared for the entire game to lose meaning thanks to all the laughing that you'll be doing. Number five, The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. If you want a relaxing adventure where you essentially become a master of all trades, super powered deity that is beloved by all, then Skyrim is the game for you. Well that is, as long as you're playing on PC and you can mod the glitches out. Another glitch that should not have been removed, if a man wishes to take his spectral out of the physical plane of existence and drag his now dead body to your wedding as a way to show his approval of your marriage, then he should be allowed to do so. Number 4, WWE Smackdown. I don't actually know which particular Smackdown game this glitch exists in, but I don't think that's important. What is important is that we all enjoy the revelry in watching something that is both funny and impossible in the real world. It's a good thing gifts loop because that just makes rewatching this trade of blows between a staircase made of flubber, two men made of the most muscular of polygons that much easier. Number 3, Assassin's Creed 4. Black Flag is easily the best game in the series and a big part of the reason why it's so good is the nautical battles and pirate themes and this glitch plays a part in that role as well as including a homage to a famous pirate themed ghost story that may or may not have been in Spongebob. Well like its successor, it's not without its technical problems. This game shows that no matter where you go you will always find glitches. Well, either that or the game is haunted, and that is actually the ship of the Flying Dutchman and the captain has just taken the virtual souls. Number 2. Battlefield 3 had some serious issues in the beta, but pretty much everyone's forgotten those glitches, well, except for one particular glitch that's almost impossible not to laugh at. I mean, he looks like the offspring of a creature from beyond our perceived dimension, and Mr. Fantastic. The way he fires his gun using telekinesis will surely bring fear into the hearts of your loved ones and an uncontrollable laughter that could possibly lead to death by asphyxiation. Number one, Red Dead Redemption. That's right, it's another Rockstar game. Red Dead is the game that has the single best DLC, adding hours of content, zombies, and apparently horse carts with some fully sick hydraulics. Of course, not every feature is without its hazards, if you're not careful, your bouncing horse cart will launch you into low orbit and kill you. The best course of action would be to stand back and enjoy the bunny hopping from a safe distance. That's it for this countdown. And have a go